Hello my amazing sexy mofos, this is your boy Venomy here, I really do hope you're all okay and having an amazing day so far. In today's video I am back with another Forza Horizon 5 anti-lag drag tune, the car work that we're going to be playing with today is the GT40 Mark 1. Now before we start, if you are new around here and like what you see, then please do subscribe to join this amazing sexy family. But now let's jump straight into this. Okay, so what I have for you today is once again another old school car, 1964 Ford GT40 Mark 1. For the customization, the engine swap, we're going with the 8.4 liter V10. We are making it all wheel drive as well, and of course, adding that twin turbo option. The tires and rims, drag tire compound tires, and make the rear tire width as big as possible. If you can, because of the weight of the car as well, to get it down, make sure you go for a lighter rim set. Now, the engine upgrades, this is all your power and your speed. Of course, you want to put every single thing here onto race. Turbos, make sure you put on the anti-lag race turbos, not the normal ones. Super, super important. But other than that, just make sure everything is on race. Now, when it comes to the next category, platform and handling, race brakes, front and rear, race anti-roll bars, off-road springs and dampers. Don't worry about a roll cage, adds a little bit too much weight. For the weight reduction, make sure you put that on race as well. Now for the final category, drivetrain, stock transmission because of the engine swap, race, driveline and a drift differential. When you've purchased, put all of that on, purchase it all, then come to tuning. Now just pause the video every time I change category, copy it all down, write it all down, then you'll have a fantastic bass tune for the 1964 4GT40 Mark 1. It's definitely a sleeper, definitely tweakable with this tune as well. The final drive is set to 2.75, but if you wanted a little bit more top end, because 2.75 I feel is the perfect balance of acceleration and top end for this particular car. Just obviously with the engine it's got as well 2.75 if you put it to 3.0 uh, just for a bit more acceleration you can't do over 200 but 2.75 it's the perfect balance between but yeah 2.75 for the perfect balance 3.0 for more acceleration and then 2.50 for more top end but the share code is 127678605 now I'm going to leave you all with the rest of the footage, I really do hope you go on to enjoy it, it is a really nice car, it can't beat Jesco's obviously, I don't think there's a lot of cars in the game that can actually even pull that off, and of course cars like the McLaren F1, all the top dogs, Copo Camaro, you guys know the type of cars I'm talking about, the type of cars, the Diablo, there you go, there's another, it's not going to be beating anything like that. But it is a really nice car, it's going to be beating any sleepers. Um, I would like to actually try it as well with the V6 twin turbo, because looking at the stats, they're not that much different off the V10. So definitely expect a second tune with that engine. But I'm going to wrap this video up here. I really do hope you're all okay and having an amazing day so far. If you have enjoyed anything you've seen, then please do drop a like on the video. It really does help me out a lot. And if you are new around here, please do subscribe to join this amazing sexy family. But I love every single one of you. And I'll see you all in the next video.